Welcome and here we are guys we're back on my old base for two reasons the first reason is that I wanted to collect some frost crystals so that I can set a small farm up so that I can produce the necessary frost crystals to produce the glass blocks that I'm going to need in new, my new base. I will still be coming back here to collect frost crystals but I just want a bit of a farm running it would be a temporary farm but while I'm actually building the, the, my new base up the other reason I came here is that if you watched the previous video I was talking about the fact that I couldn't find the interior stairs and I came back here and checked here and the interior stairs are actually in here and I've went out and gathered quite a lot of salvage technology so I'm just going to keep unlocking these items here um, I mean I've, I'm not going to replace the wooden steps for the moment because at the moment I quite like the, them because and what I want to do is an experiment to see if I can get them in the middle of the room with the blocks. But that will make sense in a little while. So we're just going to keep grabbing everything we can here. I'll what I want to do is eventually unlock everything in here. Metal floor panel, small wood panel, the short wall there. There's a metal ramp there. We can gather that. Half wooden ramp. And we're now down to just... I think we can take the concrete doorway and that's it. So that's unlocked a whole no raft of items I can build with. Because I would like to get them all unlocked so I can experiment with them in a new base. The other thing I've also done is I've clicked on this here. And as you would have seen in the bottom right before it disappeared, I they've, they've given me an off-planet mission. I would like to do that in this part if possible simply just because that's to get it tidied up and the other thing I want to show you before we get into the main focus of this video which is a bit of base building is you can see in the community research now we've reached the past tier 2 and we've got 31% into this area although I'm not sure why that's 31% but we still got 5 days 5 hours so what I want to do in the not in this part but in the next couple of parts is get back to exploration to make a contribution towards that community research and I just want to check that make sure I've got all the resources I need before we go to the new base yes sodium transfer yep, that's looking good and what we're going to do now is go to the new base and the, the thing about that computer archives mission if I show it to you is that if I do that there's a good chance what will happen is it will then do the last step in the purge because I've only got one more walk to go to do that purge if that happens I'm not going to do that in this video what I will do is do a specific video for the end of, end of the purge mission so here we are we're at the site of my new base and one thing I do want to do is I've come here I pick this up if I can find it can never find it I picked up the uh, oxygen harvester I'm not going to use it I just picked it up and brought it here as a way of saving a little bit of time in the future I've also loaded up my uh, exocraft with some ferrite dust which I bought so we're just going to pick that up, shove that into the exosuit. And we're just going to put some pure ferrite into here. And we're just going to begin. Why is that saying 100? Oh, pure ferrite. I put pure. Stop, 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 stop. And I, I made that mistake I, in the last part, didn't I? Um, yep. Yeah, I made that mistake in the last part. I'm going to need to hook out some uh, ferrite dust from here. Yeah, I can't, apologies, I can't remember who pointed it out to me, but my accident. Why am I... Oh, I need to get, because I'm still on the exocraft. Okay. Right, I'm just going to do this, and we should now be able to... I wonder if I can put this in directly. Would that allow me now? Pure ferrite dust. Right, I've got some ferrite dust here. Yeah, I need to be a little bit more careful with my pure ferrite. 
and what we're going to do is just come in here and we're just going to find the gardening stuff and we're just going to come back here and what I want to do is just drop in I'd, I'd like to get four of these in and I'd like, I'm not going to plant up all of them Oops. back one up one well, I think I want to get about three because I want to leave enough frost crystals. I think I worked out that I could plant up three of these and have enough left. Or oh, I could do two actually. Player inside object. Thank you. I think what we'll do is we'll, we'll, we'll do. Oh, I've done three of them anyway because I'm talking. Great. And what I want to do and of course what I need to do now and that is come in here and we're going to build some because of course we've got to build some glass what was it? I, I think my calculation said six yep and what we're going to do now is come here control one two three this is where it all goes wrong where I get all my calculations wrong I mean, this is going to be very much a work in progress. And we're just going to come across here. Up, oh, we're going to put the door back in for the moment. Eventually, I'll replace this with a holographic door. I just want to see. Yep, that's looking great. So we've got this area here. And I think what I want to do now is just take out these blocks here and the other thing I'm probably where's the basic building that's the basic building isn't it because it's this corner here has been annoying me a little bit oh. it's not gonna it's not gonna go in there is it oh that's annoying then again I suppose I can always live with it I can find some way to hide this little joint here. As I, as I was saying, I'm, I'm quite happy with this uh, staircase going in like that because I, I had a bit of an idea of when I was looking at that and that is to go back one more step out the back here. Wow, what's that rock back again? Okay, we'll just dig out this rock here. Right. So what I'm thinking guys is to come back one more room up here. Oops, maybe I should have done this. Well, I should have done this from the inside, shouldn't I? This is not gonna oh so it is, it's gonna work, okay. Because I think that will blend this into this a bit easier. And it would give me a bit more space down here. Let's just get rid of this while I'm looking at it. Okay. Not that I'm going to get back this far. But if the game's going to regenerate these every time I uh, load the game, I might as well take advantage. Oops, no, that needs. I'll analyse that to get the second mineral. And I'm just going to grab this. Must admit, I spent a couple of hours at my original base gathering those resources. It's quite surprising how quickly things go. I'm just going to grab here, and I'm just going to exit suit, and see if we can find some more. That's 226. I suppose we could just shove that in there. That's going to that's ferrite dust, pure ferrite. That's going to be 220. How much pure ferrite have I got now? 250. <laughs> it's going to be a long, long process, but I think we can get in another one here. And just going to come across up one. That. When I get into that crash, I keep thinking that it's actually going to be destroyed. But just to show you in here, guys, see. I like this idea. Uh, 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 we've got the floor floating free here now. 
Okay. I, I think we're going to have to put the floor in. I don't think I've got enough. Oh, yes, I have. I've got the pure ferrite for this, so... It's better to put the floor in. If this doesn't work, then life might get a little bit interesting. And it's probably going to tell me that I'm inside of the... And we're just going to come back this way. Oh, no. This is what I'm looking for, is this to hang. It's going to look a bit odd. And we... But I like the idea of having the base because... If you remember my previous series when I built a base, we had to put a solid block in here to put the the stairs in. And I'm hoping that this was going to work. So that we can have a, a nice solid floor up here with an open staircase. I mean if it doesn't work guys, I can always change it. This is but this is base building. Base building by its very nature means you change everything and anything as you go along. And Right, this is. I'm just going to go into the exosuit. I'll see this. Let's pull some more. Oh, let's pull some more pure ferrite over. I probably need some more. Another one of these medium refiners or a large refiner, to be honest. Ferrite dust begin. I mean, I don't know if I can actually build one. Let's see if I've got the resources to build one. Uh, if I can find out where it's actually at. Right, we need some dihydrogen jelly to make a second one. I don't think I've got any, enough resources to make some a dihydrogen jelly. Dihydrogen jelly. Oh, yes, we can. Okay. That's a turn up for the book. Come here. I'm just going to put a second one in. Ferrite dust, make sure I. Is that okay? And just gonna put that there. Now I've got to be careful. I don't put in pure ferrite. What I'm thinking, guys, is we're gonna have glass on the top here. I'm just gonna knock out this area here. And I'm just gonna. Hopefully clear this away before the local sentinel shows up. And we're okay for here. Nothing else here. And just going to... Up, across, up. And then... Uh, we're out of pure ferret again. <laughs> right. And we're we'll just going to put in the floors. No, he's prob they're, they're probably both finished anyway, so. Right, exosuit. Pure ferrite, pure ferrite, ferrite dust. Right, you're still going, thank you. Never know, if I stand here long enough, the, uh, the frost crystals will grow up. I'm just going to put in here. And up and back. Right, we can get one, two, three in there. And just gonna nope out again. Okay. Uh, tab. Exit craft. Chop oh, some more. I think we'll probably do about another fifteen hundreds worth of refining, and then we'll go off and do something else, guys. So I'm aware that just putting in blocks like this 
isn't the most exciting thing to do. Oh, that's still going. How far off? Uh, yeah, he's just finished. That's good. Bit of perfect timing there. That's fair right there. Definitely 250. And let's come across. Oh, back too far. Ah. Let's just mine out this here so it's out the way. bit of carbon, might as well just tidy this up while I'm at it. Oh, I've analysed this one. Might as well do it, just for... Yeah. Actually, I just saw a symbol here. The ancient bones. Is that still pointing at the ones... That's an armoured clam, that's an armoured clam. Oh, just curious guys, sorry. There's available, oh, it's just available resources, sorry. That's me being a bit, a bit weird. It's been a bit of a, a rocky start to this weekend, to be honest guys. A bit too much and I had quite a lot planned and I've had to be a little bit more rational in my view of the world. Um, just yep, yeah, 250. I'm just going to um, get another 250 in here. Yep, 250. I'm just going to come across. Too sure why it's gonna. I suppose because I've destroyed something here. There must be a plant here. Yeah, there's a plant here. Oops, should have analyzed that. Well, I can analyze this one. I mean, it's possible that I may take away these edge ones, or what I might do is come out a little bit wider from this perspective. So when I put the glass in, we may come out a little bit wider. Or alternatively, I may... Actually, I could do that, couldn't I? I could come out one more block and go down the side with glass. Like I did in my old base. But I don't want this to look like my old base. Well, think about that, guys. Anyway, we've got a bit more ferrite dust. I think we're going to go one more cycle with these. And then we're going to go off and do something different. So I'm just going to come down here. And you can kick you off. And I'm just going to... Pure ferrite, pure ferrite, pure ferrite, ferrite dust. So I'm just going to chunk her out that cycle. And back up here. I think it's looking okay. I mean, I just want to see the height. I suppose the only way I'm going to prove. I think what I'm going to do, guys, is is I'm going to come back in here because so I don't want this room to be too deep. But at the same time, I do want it to be. Yeah. So this is now starting to come. Why won't that? So that's now. I mean, I could cut right through the centre here because this ridge isn't too high. But that would make one big massive room. And do I want a big massive room? Let's just have a look inside. 
getting a bit low on the oxygen as well. Just missed the door. <laughs> If I go forward a couple of blocks with glazing, um, can I? I could make this into my farming area. Yeah, maybe I could go back another few blocks. I mean that. Let's, work, let's just go back down again. Sorry, guys. I mean it's bound to change anyway. I could attempt fate here by saying that I haven't actually had any storms so far, but <laughs> he, that doesn't mean anything. Um, let's get into photo mode. And so this is pushing back. Uh, let me see if I cut through here. I th maybe we'll create a farming room coming back here into this area and then maybe find some way to drop down towards this area here because I just don't want a massive cube like structure through here actually I just had a thought guys if I come up one more if I square this room off and then come up one more I could actually put a a tube out of here and we could have the central like the circular constructs through this center so it's not big yeah i think that's what i'm going to do guys i'm going to squ square off this cube shape here we're going to go up one more floor and then what we're going to have is is like a an elevated structure over the terrain of the circular bases which we can then use for um, more growing yeah i think that will work so that's what we need to do and I'll decide that and then I will tear it all down again. Anyway, what I'm going to do is just grab a bit more out of the here. I mean, I don't know if I've got any more ferrite dust. I think we're pure ferrite. Here. I'm just gonna just whack it in there and we're just gonna use this up and then what I want to do is work on what I said is we're gonna go back to the original base and do that mission oops back back one up one right and that will be it for this building session, I think, guys. I'm quite happy with that. I think eventually I may turn some, say, once I've worked out here, if I come out one level here, so I've got a nice wide balcony on the top here, maybe I will turn these in, this one into a glazed area as well so that we've got a really big open front I must admit, I'm a bit disappointed with the storage vaults that I can't put them in here because I would like to have made, let's say, this back wall my vault room. I mean, I'll have one more go. I'm, I'm the eternal optimist, just in case I made a mistake in the last part. And we come up here. No, these aren't going to come in. This is what I would have liked to have done, is had my storage, some storage vaults across the back here. But for some reason, it's not going to let me do that. Never mind. That's the way it goes. We can only build within the limits of the game. And what I'm going to do now is we're just going to go back to my uh, my original base, primary base. There we are. And actually, seeing I'm here, where's my exit? There it is. There it is. Yep. Thank you. Before we go out, I've, you know, I've been at this for a little while. And one of the reasons why I still want to stay in this base is because in this direction is uh, a very convenient patch of frost crystals. Although this convenient patch doesn't seem to have grown that quickly. 
it's also got this little patch of um, dihydrogen and as, as I said every time you reload the game this respawns so oh, we've got frost warts here but I think these other frost warts aren't quite ready so this is critical exposure to it says we've got two minutes to go for that okay now I've got to be a bit careful with my Roma here because I don't actually have a Roma base here anymore I picked it up so I've got to be a little bit careful in the sense that I, I can't leave it and then summon it because I've got no way to summon it anymore oh and that's the other neat feature now I think this must have been introduced as uh, as one part of one of the recent updates because uh, I ever noticed that when you teleport in now if your landing pad is close to the teleporter it actually puts the ship onto your landing pad now which is something you didn't do and again if any of you guys watch my permadev series you will be aware that I had a problem where my ship was landing right next to my base and one wing was going into one of my hemispheric planters I think I've gone a long way actually so I think I better drop a save actually come to think of it and I mean, this is all a bit of a mess actually got loads of carbon I should have sent some of that into the uh, what we call it um, uh, the Colossus but of course I've now I couldn't have sent it anyway because I'm too far away anyway that's my problem guys what we're going to do now is we're just going to take off and we're going to change to the base archives mission get up into space Right guys, I've just had a very rare crash. As you saw, I, I took off and I got up into space and suddenly the game crashed, but I'm, I don't think it was actually the game. I got a feeling that something kicked off on the machine which took the game out. So we're gonna give it another go. Um, we're just gonna, yeah, we're okay for the save. So we're just gonna get up into space <laughs> for the second time. Wow. Look at that planet there. I can get clear of these asteroids. I need a bit of tritium anyway. And of course I'm not getting tritium, I'm getting silver. Oh, come on. It never gives me tritium when I actually need it. Oh, all it does is give me loads and loads of silver. Let's just get clear so that I've got a nice clear view. And we're just going to, I think we're going to get a picture of this, guys. Oh, yeah. This has got to be the thumbnail. Just going to get this, see if we can get this into a view for the thumbnail. I'm going to press shift to hide. And that is going to be the picture. That has got to be the thumbnail. That new planet in the background. That is really, really cool. I like that. Anyway, right, let's... And the mission. I don't want the Atlas Station, I want the current mission. So it looks like we've got a system with three planets in. I I could have been here before, so you never know. Oh, and it looks like we've flown straight into the middle of a space battle. Thank you, game. Arch archive location detected, yes. Remote Is that it? Data injection sequence received. That is the last glyph it should be. Yep, so we've now got 16 out of 16 glyphs, as I thought would happen. And the game has now changed. A new galaxy awaits. This is the mission where you choose to go to a new galaxy or stay in the Euclid galaxy. But that is going to be for the next part, guys, because that's quite long and involved. And it's a, a key decision, which I want to treat as a separate item to this video. And right, uh, energy surge detected, portal ley line located. Okay, I've got a portal ley line as well. Oh, there's something's a lot going on here. Visit remote archive terminal base, it's located in off world archive. Yes, well, I'm gonna have to deal with these yozos first, and I, I suppose I could talk to this guy. Uh, what we got here, something, yeah. I've been hailed by a passing freighter. The last place to call seems distressed. Just 
dire need of assistance. Okay, we're going to offer health. We might as well have a bit of a space battle. And I don't want a rocket launcher. I want to get the photon cannon. Cycle targets with one to three. This is where I'd probably get in and get myself killed. Since out of range, come on. Round behind. Hey, get in range. Got gotcha. yeah, got some magnetized ferrite. At least I've got a space station in this system. All right. Gotta be careful not to hit the friendlies. Got gotcha. you. Right, there's another one down here. Okay, come on, 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 out of range. Definitely got to get myself a decent fighter. So I can be, or at very least, an explorer that's tricked out with weapons. Because the freighter's okay, but it's a bit cumbersome from the perspective of actually taking out these ships. And he's getting a bit too close, close to the freighter for my liking. I'm just gonna I've got here. Gotcha. Come on, come on, come on. Did I get him? Yeah. Well, he blew up. Don't know if I can grab those. Yep, yeah, got them. I think he's on the other side of the freighter. I don't want to shoot at the freighter. I'm going to need to get let get clear. Come on, get clear. Stop hiding. Can't even see him. He's definitely on the other side of the... F Is he on the other side of the freighter? I mean, they're firing at this side. Okay, let's just get away. Sometimes if you get in too close to the, the freighter, you you can't actually see what you're doing. Okay, let's just get clear. All right, he's out of range. We've now got a target lock on him. Yeah, we've drawn him away from the freighter itself. Now, are you guys going to be suitably grateful? Emergency comms established. Bikin, the life form must be the captain of the freighter. Looks greatly relieved. The jester is it is welcome me aboard. End communication. Well, um, the ever the optimist. So what we're going to do is we're going to come in here and we're going to just get in here, guys. And we're going to go talk to our friend, the freighter. Oh, also, that reminds me that my freighter missions have been finished as well. So maybe just to wind this video up, we're, we'll go and check them out as well. Although I'm going to have to be a bit careful because I'm, I've got a feeling my freighter's got a little bit of fuel. I've, I've got the missions. I've, I've, I've made some more frigate fuel so that I can send them off on another mission. Okay, let's, let's go see what this guy wants. Right, guys, are you going to give me a reward? An interloper. You always call me an interloper. The alien barks loudly, battle cries, and uh, as I approach, celebrating our victory, I hope. They gesture towards the control panel and suggest that I take command. Yes, and I'm not going to be able to afford it. There we are. 21 million. I'm just a, few, a little bit short. Can I get 21 million? I'm so tempted, guys. So tempted. 
Could I get the extra million? I wonder if he's going to stay around here for a little while. Oh, sloot. Okay. And I didn't get anything. Now, there is a space then. I don't really have anything here to sell. That's the problem. But I do on my... F oh, we got a Gek Relic. That's not going to make me a million, is it? Now, I did have some resources that I picked up. And I can't remember where they are. Or am I getting distracted? I, I can really hate this game sometimes. Purge, trace the ley, ley lines to the portal. Yeah, I don't want to go to that portal because that's the mission. What I want is that. I'm, I'm going to get back on mission, guys. Sorry. I know I'm passing up an opportunity to, to get a, a, a nice big freighter, but... I'm just a little bit worried about that. Right, we've got that mission there. Right, I'm going to do this first before I go to the space station. Stay on mission, Stephen. Stay on mission. Don't go wandering off, getting distracted. What I should do is put a big post-it on the bottom of my monitor saying, always stay on mission. Oh, we're on another water world. And this looks like very much like an abandoned building. It's not a problem. Oh, come on, game. I was trying to land there. When I've got plenty of fuel, I actually made a bit too much, actually, guys. Hostile. Isn't that a surprise? Yes, I know. Game. Let's have a quick look. Is this a new one? Yeah, it looks like it's a new one, so we can claim that. And so we got a new system. Yeah, stop nagging me. I have reached the location marked by my base computer. The remote archive for the hum terminal hum is waiting my input access memory. Attempting to read memory at uh, some more hexadecimal. OX 00FF1A. Did it know what I had done to it? Was it angry, upset, alone, afraid? Could a sentinel feel such things? It hovered before me. It's like catching upon a thousand crystal shards all around. As I moved on, it travelled by my side. The night it dreamt of the warp cage, but there was no more pain within. The drone looked at me, and I knew that I had been forgiven. I had fixed it. I had answered for my sin. I shall call it Laylapse. Search for physical cube. Have I got myself a drone? I searched the physical catch attached to the terminal. Whoever has recorded this message also left a piece of technology. We couldn't have... Oh, there's the ubiquitous problem and ugly up there. No, I can't see there's any drone in here. I would have seen it on somebody else's YouTube video if there, there was now a drone in the game. It would have been awesome if there was, though. Imagine. I'm certainly not going to zap these things. I think we can... Might as well scan these while we're at it. Get some spiky plants. Did I see some creatures here? Yeah, it looks like there's some creatures in the water. There's drones around. Can I escape him? If I dash underwater... You should be able to scan these underwater, because... I, I think I'm reasonably... Okay. Okay, clear off. So we're just gonna slide across. Ah, uh, there's times I could really hate drones. So we've just got that. I've still got one more over the top. I'm, when I was manufacturing the ship fuel, I was trying to get to 20 and I, I lost count. Right, these guys should have now stopped looking for me. So we should be able to get back up into space. And we're going to head for the space station. And I've just noticed the time, guys. So I think we're going to do our the honours in the space station. It looks like we might have another space battle as well. 
and then that's where I'm going to wind the video up. Right, guys, and what I'm going to do in the next part is, oh, okay, here we. Right, we've got hostiles coming in, and I'm I'm just going to keep going for the space station, so I'm near, but we'll probably have to fight for it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, quick. Oi! Well, these guys are coming in hard and heavy. Oops, I got overheat. Oh, great, 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 great. That's all I need. Should have cooled off by now. Okay, we'll use the phase beam. Oops, a daisy. Wow, you guys are hitting me hard. You're hitting me really hard. Amazing, if you start hitting them, they stop firing at you. You got any more buddies around here? What a bit of chrome, nothing found, okay. Yeah, that was... Actually, there's a... What's that there? Unknown planet. Alright, let's get in here, guys. There's some frost crystals there. While I'm at it, I'll see if I can pick up a bit of... I need some more tritium. Because... Uh, I burnt up quite a lot of tritium, making the frigate fuel. Right, let's just get in the space station. There's that frigate, there's that freighter still here. Oh, wow. And here we are, guys. We're back in here. have a look what we got well that can go to the freighter because eventually I will build up my freighter base we got a shield module C I could probably sell that actually it's uh, but we will pick up uh, something new here we'll just go and Exosuit upgrade. I mean, we can get another technology slot for 350. I mean, that could be useful because I could then add something else to here. Um, or we could just go for 41 slots for 160,000. Although, 700,000, no. I think we're going to go for the cheaper one here. I will go looking for drop pods to try and fulfill those more expensive ones. That's something for the future. Okay. Uh, purchase upgrade modules. I think we will sell this for 57. Because I, I don't really want a C-class ship module. And you can see I've got loads of nanites. I mean, I'd sooner sell that. And how how, how is my ship? protection modules I mean I think my ship protection modules are pretty good actually ship shield uh, although it, it doesn't look like I've actually got that much protection I've put this in the way haven't I okay uh, this is an ex the exocraft guy isn't it this is the ship guy let's have a quick look and see what he's got in the way of uh, purchase upgrade modules, photon cannon. Okay, <laughs> maybe I've outsmarted myself there. Never mind, it's, it's not that big a problem, of course. The eternal optimist, no. 
and I don't think I've got any missions to hand in but we'll just go and check guys because I've been doing various bits and pieces off camera So we'll just go and see what this guy's got in the way of missions. I suppose I could sell off. Hello, you're waving at me. Got a Gek Relic to sell as well. I'm just going to um, a journey, yeah, a browse missions. So we've got no new missions here. Take a photo of a monolith. We're certainly going to do that. I've got a load of photo ones, and I need to do something about that. We'll kill one predator. Yep. Yeah. That's that's an easy one, given mine. There, take a photo of a manufacturing facility. Yep, yeah, we'll take that. Uh, and that's about it. And we're just going to sell off that Gek relic, just to make a bit of space. Uh, it's only twenty-two thousand, but twenty-two thousand is twenty-two thousand. Um. I um, don't think I've got anything in my ship that I can sell. Nope. I've got some valuable resources stashed away somewhere. It's just that I can't remember offhand exactly where they are. Right, guys, I think this is where I'm going to leave it. I've, I've gone a little bit ragged at the end of this video. Apologies for that. In the next part, we will definitely be going to complete the purge and what i'm going to say guys is i'm going to go through the process of choosing the new galaxy but i think with this series i want to stay in the euclid galaxy because i want to stay part of the community events and i'm not sure whether if i go to a new galaxy i'm going to lose that but what i am thinking about doing is starting a permadeath series where if that develops and if i survive then i will be going to a new galaxy so this is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you've enjoyed the video. Hope you found it interesting. And until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming.